Hey guys, it's your boy Moon Eater here again, and today I'm reviewing the pirate customer versus the YouTuber customer. Now, if you guys don't know, the pirate customer does come with the pirate set when you do buy the pirate set, and the YouTube customer or the YouTuber does come with the gamer set. But before you get into this video, I'd like to ask you guys to go down below, smash like, and subscribe with the bell icon on so you guys do get notified whenever I upload another video. Now, without further ado, let's get right into this. Now, one last thing, shout out to Kung Fu Daniel right here. He is giving me another $800 million. And as you guys can see, I have $1.5 billion. Now what I'm planning on doing is when I reach 500 subs, I'm planning on live streaming my restaurant and giving away $100 million every 100 subs to one person. So if you guys do want that, then once again, go down below, smash like and subscribe, and I will do that. Now without further ado, let's get into it. So if I quickly pull something up here, I'll show this on screen right now. You guys can see the gamer customer stats and the power customer stats. Now, these do come from my boy Cool Colin XYZ. He joined my Discord and he's now helping me get information on this type of stuff. So, the pros are like you guys can see this. I'm not going to read this all up, but you guys can pause the video and read this if you want. But you guys can see the food price. The average food price is $3,668. This means this. This is how much money they will give you. Now, I'm assuming this is a lobster, but I could be wrong. I didn't ask, so I'm assuming this is lobster, so please keep that in mind. Arcade Machine, they give you more money. They give you 10 times the amount of money. The paparazzi, which is like, you know, people with cameras and stuff, they come in and they pay 10 times as much. And, you know, YouTuber customers bring in, a, a, like, a bunch of uh, paparazzi. Um, they also bring in more gamer customers with the play buttons. You can, and by the gamer customers, he means the YouTube customers with the play buttons. Now the cons are the table type is not the same because you know like the table is it's it's a small table and all that so you can read this if you want. The tables and chairs are really 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 expensive and this is true if I go over here really quick and I go over to the gamer set you guys can see the gamer chair and the gamer table right now cost like 1.95 mil for me. Now if I buy one of these, as you guys can see, it goes up to 2.44 mil. And if I buy one of these, 2.9 mil. If I buy yet another one, 3.62 mil. And it's just really, really expensive. Now if I go back here, that's pretty much it for the gamer customer or the YouTube customer. Now the pirate customer, the pros are the table type is the same as Royal and Tiki, which means, you know, it's like two two tables long. It's like two long. So if I come over here and quickly show you, because I want you guys to understand this perfectly. So as you guys can see, this table is just one singular table. But if you go over to the pirate table, you guys can see it's like two tables long. You guys can see the money consistent with it being $1,950. Now this is lobster. I am 100% sure as this is how much pirate customers pay me. Now cons, it doesn't give as much money as the gamer on average as the gamer does cost more than the, uh, the pirate customer. So there's no extra effect of it coming in and no extra money given in items such as the gumball machine, candy machine, popcorn machine, stuff like that, which means they won't give extra. Now, the main thing I found is, I actually don't know if this is any different, but as you guys can see here, the pirate table and the pirate chair. So, the pirate table has a 5% chance to attract the exclusive pirate customer. When combined with pirate chairs, this goes up to 20%. Now, this means if you have one table and four chairs, the chances of getting a pirate customer in that one set will go up to 20%, which means one in every five customers will be a pirate customer. Now, if we go over to the gaming uh, set, you guys can see a flashy and comfortable chair. It has a 10% chance to attract a YouTube customer that was the chair. When combined with the gamer table, this goes up to 25%. So this means one in every four customers will be a gamer customer or a YouTuber. Now, the YouTuber can pay less than the pirate customer, but it also could pay a bunch more. Now, this is where I find my main dilemma, as the pirate, the pirate customer pays like half of the uh, maximum amount that the YouTuber customer can pay, but the pirate customer does pay that all the time. It's consistent. And the YouTuber customer, I think the lowest it will give you is around $1,000 and the highest it will give you is around $4,000. Now please do keep in mind, this is without double profits or anything like that. So if I were, were to say which one is worth it more, I would recommend the pirate customer for if you're a beginner and the um, YouTube customer if you're a little bit more advanced, not too much more advanced. I'd just recommend if you're earning at least $10 million an hour, then I'd start recommending the gamer set. But guys, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If it did help you all, please don't forget to go down below, smash like and subscribe with the bell icon on so you guys do get notified whenever I upload another video. Also, join my Discord server, link in the description down below so you guys, do, you guys can be in videos. 
just like Kung Fu Daniel. He was here. I think he had to go. Also, join my Roblox group. Link in the description down below. Buy my merch. It's five rocks each. One of the merchandise pieces is right here. The lime shirt. So you guys can cop that and wear it in my videos if you guys want. But once again, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.